everyone. So it was Wednesday yesterday. So today is super Thursday. Well done. Right, so remember it's a name. Thursday. We need a capital letter super. Okay, so we can hear the first sound. Which letter does the word begin with? Think of the alphabet. What's its name? Great, it's a letter T. Well done. Okay, but the sound is th. Can you hear the next sound? Let's segment the word. Thursday can be segmented. Okay, so we can use our sounds. Think carefully. A. Thursday. A uh, uh, nurse with a purse. The uh, A may I play? Great. Right then. It was the thirteenth yesterday, so we need to add one more. It's the fourteenth today. Well done. So thinking of number fourteen in tens and ones how many tens are there look at the tens super there is one ten good we can make 14 using one ten okay could use numicon ten and then how many ones super four ones okay that makes 14 i could do it with deans instead so one ten because one ten is made of ten little ones all joined up together that's one ten and how many whoops how many ones we need four ones okay i'm going to draw my four ones one two three four super we've made our whole number 14 Okay, right, let's break it into two parts. I'm going to break it into two parts. And my easy way to do it is with one ten, ten here, and four ones. I'm going to do it like that first. Okay, super. How else could we do it? Can we think of lots of different ways? Can we make lots of different number sentences? You could write that one. Ten add four equals... 14. Okay, I'm going to do another one. I'm starting with the biggest number that I could use so that I have 14 altogether. Great, that's 14. Add how many? Zero. Well done. Add zero equals 14. Okay, could I do it the other way around? Yes, I could. I could. I could have it zero add 14 equals 14. I could have it that way around. Okay, how else could I do it? Could I start here with 15? No, because that's more than 14 and our problem is to make 14 altogether. So it needs to be a number that's less. So I'm going to go with 13. 13 add how many more? One more equals... 14. Super. 14 all together. Can we think of any other ways? 12. Yep, 12. Carry on counting. Count on. 12, 13, 14. Good. Add two more is 14. And let's have another one. This time I'm not going to carry on my sequence. I want you to carry on a sequence and see if you can think of all of them. But I'm going to jump along to... Nine. I'm going to put nine there. How many more do we need to add to nine to get to 14? Should we count on? Put nine in your head. Nine, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14. We need to add five more. Equals 14. Super, super addition. Well done. All right, let's do some subtraction. Some taking away number sentences. I'll rub that one out. Okay, so we're still making 14. 14 is, is our important number for today. 
So could I, if I want to make 14, if I want to have 14 left, could I start with the number that is less than 14? No, it's got to be 14 or more, okay? So, I'm going to start with 14. 14, take away. How many? Can I take any away if I want to have 14 left? I can't, can I? If I've got 14 and I still want to have 14, I can't take any away. So, that's zero. Okay. Could it be the other way around? Like when we swap our numbers for our addition number sentences? Could I have zero here? Zero, take away 14. No, I can't because there's not enough there. If I've got zero, I can't take away 14. So we'll rub that one out. Okay, another one then. What could I have next? Yeah, 15, okay. 15, take away one, good. 15, take away one, we have 14 left. Because we know one less than 15 is 14 on the number line. Super. Okay, what about 16? 16 take away, how many makes 14? Oh, some of you are so quick. Let's check. 16, your head count backwards. 16, 15, 14. So, I took two away. Let's check. 16 in your head, 16, 15, 14. It was right, we took away two. Super. See if you can make some more number sentences. Okay. How many different ways can you do it? You might want to draw, draw blobs and to cross them out. That's fine. You might count backwards using your fingers or count on if you're adding. Okay. Or you might use objects. That's okay too. Well done, everybody. See you later.